Hey guys, it's Brugus here and in this video I will talk about the deadliest gear in Watch Over Prey Arms. Now, I will start first with the weapon and here, yeah, basically this is the gear. There is just a single gear that's a good one. The second one is HP and defense. This is more likely for, for defenders. Also, this gear is more likely for the healers. When deployed, blah, 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 randomly gain 10% attack. We care about this four gear sets that is presented in the gear right one gear right two and gear right three now first of all there will be different gears for the different heroes if your hero actually cast very fast their uh, ultimate i think this one is a good choice is after an ultimate cast damage is increased by 10 percent permanently so it's basically can go to 50 percent so if your hero have fast cast on his ultimate this is the choice for you now on the other hand this is more like critical damage increasing the critical damage by 60 percent in total after you make a critical hit but again this is a time consuming this gear and this gear is actually need maybe one minute to actually perform and in my opinion, in Watcher of Free Arms, the deadliest gear is the third one. It's basically this one. Inferno Roar. A basic attack damage is increased by 40%. Of course, if you're lucky and you get pretty strong gear for one of these two things, definitely go with this one. Of course, for the weapon, I'll not talk about the weapon since there is just one gear. It's only War Ward. You definitely want to have war ward or maybe you can go for critical damage i think this is also a good pick but anyway for the rings here become actually the place where you may actually think which gear to use and in my opinion is this one i think so far this one of course it depending for attack speed but if you have nightmare units you definitely want to go for this one this is my personal opinion because Nightmare, Nightmare Wards is going to give you some attack speed and basic attack increased by 40%. This is absolutely huge boost to your heroes. And again, about this one, maybe these gears are good for the guild boss or maybe places where there is a long fight. But in general, I think this is the top and deadliest gear in Watcher of Free Arms. So I'll try to make this video just shorter. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, hit one like, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video.